I studied singing from the time I was in, um, uh, I think, elementary school, really, I started. And then I won a scholarship to the Metropolitan from music and art. Um, it never occurred to me that I should be an actress. And then someone was kind enough to explain to me that acting and singing are really primarily the same thing, and that if you are performing a song, you're acting. So I began to study, and eventually I went to um, Actors Studio for a while. Lee Strasberg was holding classes then, and I think that was my first encounter with the fact that I, I wanted to pursue it very seriously. And did you, although it is the same as you said, did you love acting as much as singing? I grew to love acting. You grew to love it. As much as singing, if not more. Because with singing, you're not as nude. There is nothing more nude. I mean, it's like walking in front of the audience with not one stitch of clothing and making them forget that you're not wearing a stitch of clothing, but that you're there to deliver something that we can all enjoy, that I enjoy giving, and I hope you enjoy taking. So I think that's what happened to me with the acting and the singing. Um, there was more freedom with the, uh, with the acting. I wasn't tied to a melody. I had to make my own melody with the acting. And the, and the reality is, at least from my perspective, is that many singers have not successfully um, had good acting careers. But you were able to do that. You made that transition very well. Well, fortunately, the, the Broadway theater had a lot to do with that, Broadway musicals, because I was quite young when I did House of Flowers. Truman Capote um, actually said when I auditioned for House of Flowers, he said, you're too young. I said, but the character is 15. And I was, I don't know, maybe 18 at the time. And he said, go out in the world and live. You, I've never met a 15-year-old as naive. <laughs> and I, that really insulted me. I didn't feel naive, but if I was giving the impression that I was naive. So I came to California, flew into Los Angeles for the film, um, Carmen Jones. 